record. All right, we're still in algebra two and we're still doing lesson 1.7 here. Up to problem four out of 10. And let's see, that would be 23 on my other numbering. All right, so we are supposed to get this in the reduced row echelon. We've done uh, whatever, three of these already, if you've watched any of those videos. The first one really explains what's going on here. And then after that, we're just using the buttons to in the uh, Desmos matrix calculator to do all the work for us. I'm not gonna make you do this stuff by hand. That's painful um, at this point. If you ever go on to some higher level mathematics beyond high school, you'll probably have to really become more efficient and demonstrate you understand this whole process. But there's so many places you can make arithmetic mistakes. I am perfectly fine with you just using our Desmos matrix calculator to solve these. So you're going to uh, take and create a new matrix. We're gonna make sure it has three rows and four columns in the bottom left. We're gonna just start typing them in. The negative one, one, negative three, 15 in the first row, four, zero, negative one, negative five in the second row, zero, four, two, 10 in the third row, enter it in the bottom right button. And we're gonna to go to the bottom left, RREF, reduced row echelon form, and do matrix A. And it gives us our answers again. So easy, it almost seems like we shouldn't even get credit for doing a problem like this. So it was negative two, four, negative three that I need when we now hop on back to Sevis. And we're gonna put the one, zero, zero, negative two in the first row. In the second row, zero, one, zero, four. In the third row, zero, zero, one, negative three. That's reduced row echelon. X is negative two, Y is four, Z is negative three. Check it, if we did it all right, bam. We are flying through these problems on reduced row echelon and Let's keep at it. Hopefully you're understanding. If not, again, the first problem I go through what's really happening when they're solving that. So keep at it. Good luck. 